Imagine a server filled to the brim with Minecraft's greatest PvPers, exploiters, manipulators, and littlest Ks. Well, wait, how'd that get in there? You'd think someone like me, with a low PvP rating and absolutely no influence other than lore would be even able to survive. So instead of taking my usual approach to gaining power, this time we're gonna use a broken meta to absolutely dominate the server. But what is this method, you may ask? Well, it's horses. Kinda. So you might have heard of the Bliss SMP, and for those of you who haven't, you basically spawn in with a randomly selected item called a gem, which grants you one of eight unique abilities. And after three long seasons, I finally obtained the fire gem. But what exactly could I do with it? Let's go down, Ember. Oh, we have iron! Again, oh, no, I mean, smelted. Uh, Nova, did you summon another warden? As you just saw, I can smelt materials and food! Here's a smelty circle thing. I have some things I want to smelt. Human furnace boy. Human furnace. Whoa! And set people on fire, apparently. First things first, we needed a base. What? It's Whoa, so awesome. guys. That's literally oh amazing. Oh my god. Dude, e will, E will. Whee! If you hit me, you're an op. <laughs> If you hit me or not, don't do it. Ember's dead. Ember's dead. Why? Ember's dead? Actually, death message in chapter. She's gone. What the actually, wrong yeah, with you? Uh, instead, just slash oh message me that you're such a geek. Oh. Because I can't remember. I have bad memories. You're such a geek, bro. I have short-term memory loss. No, you don't. I felt peace and hope with my new team, thinking I could protect them. But then, things got bad. The Dude, peak. You're the gonna peak. Love this. We're actually based at peak, bro. Are you? That's right, e Cordor died to a skeleton, and in this server, if you die, you lose something called an energy, which is the equivalent to a life. And we only have six each! Oh god, we're being attacked! We're being attacked! <laughs> I thought we were chill, but Mok Todd, Mok Todd, Psyker, and stuff are here. Bro. Give me the diamonds! Bro! Oh, all the diamonds? We need clothes, we need clothes, guys. I see you, I see you, I see you, I see you. Oh, I'm dead. Once it all sank in, all little Kay and I could do was sit and wait while our teammates gathered allies to return everything to normal. But a feeling of dread settled in my stomach. Despite our peaceful approach, Crystalit chose to satisfy his team's greed over our friendship. So I held out faith for the next two chances I'd give him. Luckily, my next opportunity didn't take long to show up. Last season, I had an unsuccessful horse business, and I want to try it again. But why would it be different this time? Well, you see, the only movement people have is the Puff Gem's double jump and an Astra ability that lets you summon an invisible horse that literally never dies. Good news is, we can obtain one of these in vanilla, since this time around, hardly anyone has Puff or Astra. Woohoo! Alright, let's go, horsey. Go fold, 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 fold. Woo! Almost there, come on. Ah. Now with a more diverse range of patterned horses, I'm more likely to sell some for a higher price to pair uniquely with their owners. And it wasn't long until I got my first customer. Well, sh for those of you huh? unaware, Muggum was highly regarded as the most cunning, most unpredictable evil on the server. His only goal is to gain more power and he will be willing to do anything to obtain it. All right. Help yourself. Oh damn, you really just do not have any dark horses. Yeah, but if we could breed this one with one of the patterned horses and possibly get like... Do you just know that at the top of your head? Memory. Yes, I do. Okay, um, wait. Look at one take this one right here. Right, oh, bet. he does not have a dark horse. Nova! <laughs> <laughs> Nova's a demon, bro. Come here, Nova! Get my horse! Bring my horse back! No, but get the damn horse Sorry. back, bro. I ain't gonna get the horse back. It's safe in the water. Get the horse back. Damn, bro. Get it back, Nova. Fine, damn, okay. Yo, Muggum just you, like oh, me worded you, bro. That's crazy. Now, this is unexpected. Muggum was actually defending my pride from my own teammate. Uh, I don't have a sad oh, That was funny, uh, so. <laughs> <laughs> okay, let me get some out of my hand. Ember, you have way too much trust in people, bro. Um, how yeah, much I is know. this one? With the discount, she's six diamonds. Hey, what happened, okay, so bro? How much is the golden carrot? Why are you rags now? Yeah, uh, six golden carrots. Can I buy armor? I only have leather armor, but oh, I can buy can, uh, never mind. After everything that happened, I was shocked. My first buy was from the guy who disrupted balance to land himself at the top. Whether it was with ulterior motives or out of genuine interest, he had the heart to do things the peaceful way. 
the good way, which made me even more excited when I took on my next commission from Dominoko of the Dark Knights. It just so happened that this team's whole image revolved around horses. So I asked around and even talked to the admins to find a jet black horse to breed with my white ones. And finally, I found one at someone else's base. I snooped around only to find out that the base belonged to either Mugum or Whalables, two of Bliss's top five PVP players. Annoying either of them would hurt my team, damage my business reputation, and ruin our chances in the next stage of progression. Wait, progression? Oh yeah, I forgot to mention that we're all completely broke right now until Pro gets hard working on the next stage which makes us all richer and happier! Wait, 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 wait. So I decided to try and borrow this unique specimen. Just gonna be a little while. Just gonna be a little while. <laughs> yeah, my conscience wouldn't let me do that. All right, I'm just gonna do this the hard way. Please have a black coat, please have a black coat, please have a black coat, please have a black coat. Yes! Oh my god, we are champing! Ew, why did I say that? Now that I had a black coat in my possession, I had to transport it over 2,000 blocks all the way back to my base without killing it. For good measure, I decided to breed a another one. And thankfully, I got a all black this time, so let's bring him back as well. All that was left to do was to wait for Dom to come by and pick up the package. Where is Dom? Oh, there he is. Dom! Sup? Now since Dom was broke, we came to a consensus in which he'd breed a foal exactly the same as the one I'm gonna give him. Making his purchases consist of only the saddle. Dom... My bad, my bad, I'm blocking it off. Okay, okay, so I'm taking the full from these two, right? No, you know, you can get this one. Get the one with the saddle. The one with the saddle is the same as the baby. So I'll pay you the diamonds at a later time. Mm -hmm. So I'll take this one now. Mm -hmm. All right, cool. Thanks, Em. Yeah, quitting time. Gentle breeze in the air makes the to my own and stay in my lovely home. But when will the tides come to scorn us for our insolence? Will I have faith to stay afloat in the Be sure to return them safely, please, please, please. Thank you, thank you. I'm impressed you did that so quickly. That's actually hilarious. You are per you almost got me. When I realized the horses were gone, I'm like, oh my god. <laughs> no. <coughs> Impossible. That 
was the original plan, I guess. I thought you'd be long gone after. <laughs> I'm gonna kill every horse on the server. You don't gotta do this. My gem is currently on useless. I'll give you a horse for free. I'll give you a horse to kill for free. You say I can kill this yeah. horse. Go ahead. Kill okay, so I'll kill all the horses. Then. No, 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 don't kill all the horses. Calm down, calm down. Maybe if I call my teammates, they can help me. Okay, I got a response from one of your teammates saying they don't care if I kill the horses. But what if you go into acceptance about the fact that I'm back to kill these horses? I kinda don't want them to. Okay, forget saving the horses. I just need something out of this. Anything. Look at me in the eyes, alright? Do these look like the eyes of someone who cares about dying? No, and I can see it. Either you pay me off, or your horse business is gonna well, be trouble. Well, think of it, Crystalit. I'm gonna start a donkey business. And you know how people like to travel with their stuff. You can leave it okay, so behind and your stuff is safe. Right now, it's fine. I still need the other three. I don't have time. Ember, either you pay me off or I start stabbing. I just need this white one and this gray and this black one. Oh, and this Wait, brown one. you need this gray one? Is this the one you need? Mm, technically. Th this one? The, 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 the one I'm printing out? Kill it. You may not care about death in your state, Crystalit, but neither do I. I'm over the violence. If you want to choose the path of violence, fine by me. But peace takes effort. That's and how if... little these horses mean to you. Well, they earned me my fortune. I can't believe you don't care about your horses. The only oh, one the I one care about now. is the one I'm riding. What about it? He's mine. Dabby Cat has his horses and I have mine. That's all I need. At this point in the story, you might have thought I'd failed. But I didn't. I remained calm even when I was threatened. I stopped violence from causing a ripple effect that would disrupt the balance of the server, even if it meant sacrificing my business. And in the end, I made memories that would remind everyone the power we have to change our fates, for our friends, for ourselves, and for our beliefs. Um, yeah sure, I won't tell. Oh, don't worry, he's broken the last straw. I'm swearing secrecy to myself. I promise I won't tell anyone. Kate, watch out!